everyone. I'm glad you're here. Thank you very much for joining me today. Thanks to one of those in our community. You know who you are. I got a heads up about this earthquake there in Kansas. USGS said it was originally a 4.3, but they downgraded it to a 4.0. And there's been other earthquakes within this same location. Back on the 4th of this month, there was a 3.9. Um, April 6th, there was a 3.2, and then the 4th again on this month, there was a magnitude 3.4. Rivers and streams often follow fault lines, and you can see this whole area through here. There's a lot of water um, running through that. You can tell by the trees, too. Yeah, and it's not far. Let me bring it out. Do, 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 do. Over here, drawn in yellow, which is part of the Humboldt Fault. There we go. I'll bring it down. Here it does say that Kansas is not particularly earthquake prone. 45th out of 50 states uh, by damage caused by earthquakes. Yeah. The Humboldt Fault had the largest earthquake in Kansas history in 1867 uh, near Manhattan that was um, I got a 5.5 here and it was felt as far away as Dubuque Iowa okay it's not far from Manhattan here's Manhattan here's where the original 4.3 um, I got a two reports on EMSC I can show you a 4.0 epicenter a few miles north of Minneapolis, Kansas, around 6.22 p.m. And the other one says was quite a shake for Kansas. Yeah, when the largest is only a 5.5, yeah. All right, the earthquake actually occurred at 6.42 p.m. local time. 100 people said, so far they've said they felt this earthquake. It's now up to 105 intensity level 6 which means there would have been damage felt by all frightened. Some may have run outdoors, falling plaster and chimneys, small damage. So what kind of damage do you guys have? All right, close to Manhattan up here, Clay Center, intensity level six, uh, Minneapolis, intensity level six. We got some more farther. Let me bring this out, uh, Wichita. Okay, intensity level 2. Newton, intensity level 3. What else do we have here? Um, Bennington, um, intensity level 4. Um, Selena, intensity level 4. Uh, another one, intensity level 4. Yeah, so Clay Center, if any of you are watching my report, what kind of damage do you have? And then, of course, Minneapolis. Yeah. I certainly pray that everybody is safe. You know, you have everything bolted to the walls and you don't have damage. Um, check the water lines. Check the gas lines. Do not use a lighter to check the gas lines. Get a bottle of soapy water and spray the connections. And that way, um, yeah, you're not going to have an explosion. Yeah, you'd be surprised how many people don't know that. They'll just take a lighter and think they'll just give a little flame. But no, it could go kaboom. So don't use a lighter. And if you have a rotten egg smell in your home, yeah, call your utility service. This earthquake was fairly shallow, only 3.1 miles below sea level. I don't know what your elevation is there. All earthquakes are measured from sea level. Yeah, put your comments down below. I pray everyone's all right. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you for the heads up. Please stay safe, and I'll talk to you later. God bless you all. Bye.